I got a new fan brush, so we're gonna uh, add some funky details to this landscape. Now, this landscape is uh, inspired by David Hockney, if you wanna look him up on the internet. He does some uh, very nice la landscape paintings. And uh, I was inspired by uh, checking out his work on uh, YouTube. So I'm just going to kind of envelop my own style, my own colors, and uh, keep it similar to a David Hockney landscape. He's got the windy road. He's got all the uh, bits and pieces, kind of like farmland. You got the sky and uh, very vibrant, lots of color. And uh, it's fun, it's energetic. And we're gonna slap it down and see what happens. So here we go. So for the next part, I'm gonna go ahead and use uh, this fan brush. It's brand new, I just got it. The company is um, Royal. Okay. It's a cheaper brush, it was around $5 at the art store. But it should do the job. It's a fan brush. Alright, let's slap it down. So I'm going to start down here in the yellow, in this area here, using uh, the fan brush. I'm going to add a little bit of green. I'm just going to do some whisks to represent grass. So let's go ahead and zoom in on that. Alright guys, I'm using uh, Liquitex soft body paint. And I've got a green here, so I'm just going to put a little bit on, don't need too much. There we go, we got our green. Now let's dip into the water, get our brush nice and wet. And wipe that off. So you have those uh, little teeth sticking out, that's what's going to give us the blades of grass. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just kind of brush it on like that. Wipe off the excess, just dab it around, wiping off the uh, excess, just for a little bit. So it should look like this. All right guys, we are ready now. We have our paint on the edge of our uh, brush. We're just going to do some sweeping motion. I need a bit more paint. So I'm just dabbing. Just kind of wipe it off the edge here. Alright, let's try it again. We're just doing little dabs here. Almost looks like grass. Dip some more into the paint. So I'm going to go ahead and do more of this uh, kind of texture stuff throughout various places in the canvas. So I'm going to go ahead and roll that time lapse.
Mm-hmm. <laughs>